Welcome back to Tech Tips. Today's video is all about our flatten elevation tool, which now automatically gets applied whenever a bridge or tunnel is detected in your route. Why is that a good thing? Because it gives you much more accurate and reliable elevation data. The routing data we receive is satellite based, which measures elevation from a bird's eye point of view. Because of this, it does not provide us with the man-made elevation changes that occur when a road goes through a tunnel or across a bridge. The result? Significant peaks and valleys in the elevation profile. For example, up in Alaska, the impressive Whittier Tunnel burrows straight through a mountain. Routing through it used to give you an elevation gain of 2,858 feet. Now, thanks to some crafty engineering, the tunnel is automatically detected and its elevation flattened to give you a much more accurate gain of 55 feet for the same 2.6 mile stretch through the tunnel. As for bridges, let's look at the iconic Michael Callahan Pat Tillman Memorial Bridge at Hoover Dam. Routing along it used to give you an elevation loss of 209 feet. Now, you'll see it gets flattened out and only shows 22 feet of loss. In places with a lot of bridges, this improvement can make a big difference in a route's total elevation. It shouldn't happen often, but if you do come across a bridge or tunnel where the elevation doesn't automatically get flattened, you can still do it manually. Select the section that includes the bridge or tunnel, which pulls up your selection tools, and select Flatten Elevation. Best of all, this feature is now available to all users regardless of their subscription level so that everyone in our community has access to more accurate elevation data. Let us know what you think and be sure to subscribe to the Tech Tip playlist on YouTube.